we both know that just because you show up it doesn't mean that you're gonna well, get that's it right thing, and yeah. that's the other thing that's the other flip side right so if you're yeah. one person that you know it's just like clocking in clocking out i mean yeah through time you might gain more experience just on the mm -hmm. years in the company or whatever yeah but then how much did you actually grow in that time span if yeah. you're not like being intentional with how you're improving like you said like the athlete when you start with a new team or whatever you're taking the time to put in all of that work yeah but you're also trying to find like you have a lot of drive and motivation to actually be intentional with yeah i want to learn things right yeah and same thing when you're starting your career it's like okay yeah. let's pick up all of these things that you have to learn because it's never ending really mm -hmm. like you can't know everything yeah <laughs> right i think the well, we talk about personalities and then we talk about there's no one personality to success but the only thing that's similar in everyone is drive yeah like whoever has that drive or whatever you call it, grit or work ethic mm -hmm. it's it's all drive yeah. right if you want to be successful you're passionate yeah. about it you're obsessed about it and you do it yeah you know what i mean it's frustrating hearing people talk about like lebron james okay this guy's six nine like 285 pounds like how is he not the best player in the world right yeah. but this guy could have easily been a nobody he could have mm -hmm. easily been like not in the nba yeah. and people don't understand how much hard work it goes into just get to the nba and even for a bench player in the nba yeah. you know how much extra hours it just goes to get that you know i firmly believe like yeah not like you live in regret but if you put in more hours you have to it's all about yeah. sacrifice you sacrifice friends or you sacrifice family or yeah. something you can have more success yeah. it's just what kind of life you want to live you know yeah yeah it's definitely that's the next topic I guess we'll go into is the sacrifice, right? Yeah. With everything that you do, it doesn't matter if it's like you're trying to get a promotion, yeah. you're trying to maybe buy a house, support your family, any, yeah. anything that you do, there's going to typically, right? The, yeah. the majority of the time, you're going to have to sacrifice something, yeah. right? And think about that too. Like, I'm going to have you put your coaching hat back on. Yeah. But think about that with your players too. Mm -hmm. I know you guys are traveling, you know, for tournaments, for club yeah. season and all of that. Mm -hmm. And it's one thing to just say, oh, we just want to go to travel and have a good time. Yeah. And it's another thing to be like, okay, come on, let's have a good showing. Let's be competitive. Yeah. Let's try to win this thing or whatever, right? Mm -hmm. Yeah. And talk about those two scenarios in terms of sacrifice. So, I mean, I think we talked about in the last one, like when I was in high school, like mm -hmm. I was obsessed. I was obsessed with sports <laughs> yeah. and yeah. all that stuff. I never grasped the concept of, playing for fun mm -hmm. really that's pretty like immature of me i guess <laughs> but you know like if i'm gonna do something i'm gonna go all in like that's just me um if i'm gonna you know have my parents spend money for practice like we're gonna we're gonna work hard and we're gonna yep. do something right i can't just like you know for me i just can't do that like i see girls like who don't want to play college and we're in like 18s like you know it, it's for fun it is but other girls are obsessed like and it's just tough because for me when i was in high school like I didn't party. I didn't do anything. Like that was an easy sacrifice for me. Some people, it's hard for them to sacrifice that, you know. And everyone's different. And uh, like you say, with work, you know, do I, do I really want to? How bad do I want this promotion? Like, yeah. do I sacrifice a family and a marriage? Yeah. Like, <laughs> like I could be the most, the best bill, like the, a millionaire, a billionaire, <laughs> but most of them are divorced. Yeah. <laughs> so like, it's just like, it's a balance and it's just, yep. everyone's different and what you want, what you value. Everyone yep. is different. Yep. You know, everyone wants different things. So yep. it's just what you want and what you value and just like just making the sacrifices to get that. Yes. That's all it is. Yeah, that's very true because like you said, things are, people value different things or find different things important yeah. in life. Um, We're getting really deep right now. But it's, yeah, it is having some <laughs> kind of balance, you know, so that you can, you know, you're not just going through the motions and then, you know, yeah, not yeah, accomplishing yeah. anything. But it's finding, yeah, definitely, I think we both can relate to that, you know, like yeah. finding the right balance of sacrifice. That's all it but is. But not expecting things to just be handed to you or getting it for free. Yeah, you know? for sure.